Hi, this is Chris, and welcome to Winemaker TV. Today, we'll be bottling up a lime hop cider, so stay tuned. Hope y'all are surviving the quarantine from the coronavirus. Today, we'll be bottling up a hopped lemon-flavored cider. And when I made this, I had the Corona beer in mind. Cerveza! I had that in mind when I thought when I was making that. And the, the warm weather's getting here, and I thought that would be a great summertime drink. So when I'm grilling, if you follow my channel, and you follow me on Instagram, you see I like to have a cider while I'm grilling. So uh, today, I made it about a month ago, so today we'll be bottling up. So let's go over what you need. I have a one gallon siphon and I have my little bottle filler on there it's a fairly new device and I'm loving it oh uh, we got uh, I made a gallon we'll make eight but I only got six here I got two two other just so I can show off my my cool little carrier with the bottle opener on the front I got this for Christmas from my aunt so we'll be bottling up eight today but this only holds six, and I thought that was cool to show you. You will need capper, Ooh. dumb tops. So let's get started. All right, my bottles are right here. You want your source and your destinations a little bit lower. I have my bottling wand attached to the end of the siphoning hose, and I went ahead and put a teaspoon of sugar in each bottle so we can carbonate these. I like each of my bottles carbonated and how this works you give it a good pump and it goes into here and this is a, like a lock a valve you see this little tip when you put it at the bottom of the bottle it opens the valve and it'll fill up and what's cool is this displaces enough cider to where when it gets to the top you take it out it'll be perfect volume so I really recommend you getting one of these so I got I just set it in the first bottle Give it a couple of pumps. This is a kind of a, a scrumpy looking, scrumpy looking cider, but that's all right. So I'm just going to fill up all eight of these bottles. I said this bottling wand is amazing. You can just go bloop, bloop, bloop. I really like this. How did I make it without it? So I'm going to fill these up and we'll be right back. All right, so it's a little scrumpy from the uh, lemon in it, the lime, I mean lime in it. So we're going to bottle this up. So get you a cap. It's sitting in the sanitizer. So just put the cap on there. You have to kind of be forceful with this thing sometimes. When you hear the pop. Sometimes these things are tricky. There we go. Well, first just don't succeed. Try, try again, I guess. Let's move this out of the way. Give me some elbow room. Bottler down on there, capper down on there, and you want to right, hear it pop. That's when you know it's done. And there's some little sugar on the bottom for where we're going to prime these things. So give it a little shake, and then go on to the next one. So I'm going to finish uh, capping these off, and we'll be right back. That's what it looks like. I hope y'all staying safe during this quarantine and have you a, a Corona type cider in a few weeks. Um, if you like the work I do here and you want to help support my channel, there's uh, fi uh, affiliate links, Amazon affiliate links in the description below. If you click any of those links and go about your average uh, Amazon shopping, I will get a commission that will help to go towards buying equipment and ingredients. Also, on my YouTube page, channel page, there's a little PayPal donating that button now. If you want, if you want to kick a few bucks to me, just click that icon and 
we'll be good to go. So this is Chris with Winemaker TV, and that's all there is today.